My name is Nikola Dragicevic and I'm coming from Serbia, from Europe and I'm one of the youngest MPs in our parliament and also I think that I'm one of the youngest MPs here in this international forum and it's such an honor for me to be here. So how old are you? I'm 29 years old. 29 years old. So what do you think about the youth representation in the parliament? I think that uh, international forums like this is very important for young people, for knowing each other and for uh, knowledge of, our, of, of us. I think that we need to create a whole new generation of political establishment who will lead this world uh, on different way without war and, and conflicts. For, for all young people's, people, MPs from all over the world. Bahrain is a great country, I'm the first time here and after this experience I would uh, come here again sometimes. That's a beautiful country, beautiful people, uh, ve very loving, very open to, to others and that's a great thing. Because of the Ukraine and Russian war, mm -hmm. you know that you provide the sanctions to the Russian from the Europe side. So there are a lot of uh, criteria that are happening inside the parliamentaries as well as the countries as mm -hmm. well. So would you like to explain that as well? As, in, as a young youth representation, so would you like to say something about that? Uh, I think that Russia and Ukraine are very similar countries. Uh, same religion, same people, they used to be a part of the same country 30 years ago. Uh, and I think that uh, other European countries with help from America create some kind of chaos in that part of the world. Uh, I want to leave Ukraine and Russia to negotiate and to try to find a peaceful solution. Without all of us, I think that in this point, from, from my point of view, in this point they need to talk to each other without guns, without bombs, without fire, without helping of other countries who send them guns, you know? I think that's uh, his topic, his, his local thing, and I think that that's two great countries uh, with great leaders who can, who have enough strength to do it to, uh, to ourselves, to, to them, themselves, you know, without all of us. We need to be here to support them, to talking, to make some peaceful uh, methods and that conflict uh, is a problem for, for all Europe. That's a problem for 